Today, we are going to fix Roblox not launching on your Windows computer. If your game isn't responding, don't worry, I'll walk you through a few steps to get you back up in no time. Before troubleshooting your computer, let's first check to make sure that the Roblox servers are not down. Open a web browser and go to status.roblox.com. If you see this green message at the top, all systems operational, that means there is no issue with the Roblox servers and the issue is definitely on your end. Before we continue, restarting your PC can help close any background apps or processes that might be interfering with Roblox. We can simply go down to the bottom, hover over shutdown or sign out, and click restart. Once your computer is back on, try launching the game again. But this time, we will try as an administrator. So simply head down to the start menu, search for Roblox Player, right click, and then click Run as Administrator. If the game still doesn't open up, we're going to need to reinstall it search for add or remove programs. Use the search bar at the very top to search for Roblox. Click the three dots at the very right and then click uninstall. Next, let's reinstall Roblox. So open up your preferred browser, search for Roblox download, and then click download Windows app. Once this is done, simply press the exe file and install Roblox again. For most users, this should fix your issues, but if you are unfortunate enough that this hasn't fixed your issue, there's a couple more steps we can do. Click on the start menu and search for run. Once the run box is open, type in percentage sign local app data percentage sign and then click OK. Once this folder is open, we now have to locate the Roblox folder. You can either scroll all the way down or if you highlight a single folder and then press R, you will go all the way down to where R starts. And here we can see is the Roblox folder. So we enter this. Next up, double click on the versions folder. Click the date modified tab at the very top here so that you have the most recent version folder at the very top and then enter this folder. Now you want to scroll all the way down and find the Roblox player launcher. Right click this and click run as administrator. And as we can see here, it is also reinstalling Roblox and removing the old cache. Now, if these methods still haven't fixed your issue, there are two more that might be applicable to you. So if you have a software like MSI Afterburner that shows current FPS, that often interferes with Roblox. So if you turn that overlay off, that should help fix it. Another common issue is if you have a steering wheel or something like that, even like a joystick plugged in, that may cause Roblox to not open properly as well. If you're still having issues at this point, please do feel free to drop a comment below and I will try my very best to help you. That's all from me. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.